As you may have guessed from the glow, this is where we store element 115, or Illyrium. Understanding it is vital to our ability to adapt and adopt outsider technology. So far, our results have been mixed, at best. But I'm sure you didn't come here just for a guided tour. I'll leave you to your duties, William. Okay. Oh, do you have anything else to say to me, buddy? Agent Carter, I fear I haven't properly expressed my gratitude for the rescue you provided me. No, not nah, happy. Just to happy to have a man like you on board. We need all the help we can get. Appreciate it, Carter. I hope I live up to your expectations. Um, I wish we Shame rescue we couldn't more. rescue more survivors from Rosemont. Yes, of course. At the very least, it would be a tremendous help to have Lars here. He was an outsider, Doctor. That didn't keep him from being an excellent lab assistant. And a friend. Uh, what is Mosaic? Your assistant mentioned something called Mosaic. Said you were the key to it. Seemed to have something to do with the measurements you were taking. Any idea what he meant by that? I don't know much about it at all. Other than it controls the Venn gates connecting our worlds. And it also seems to exact some degree of influence over the denizens of that world. As to why Lawrence regarded me as the key to it remains a mystery. But what is it? Is it a, a thing? Or a person? What is it? I wish I knew, Agent. It could be any number of things. A natural force, a psychological disorder. One thing is certain, however. It does seem to be accessible via physical technology. Okay. Uh, what do you know about the sleepwalkers? The people we saw back there. The stuck ones. The ones who can't stop doing the same thing over and over. What's the skinny on them? Are they us? Or are they them? To be honest, I haven't the foggiest. I can say it was horrifying to witness my students, one by one, falling victim to the condition. How does it operate? Why does it only take some people? A mystery as yet, but one I aim to get to the bottom of. I did notice trends. More students than professors, more whites than blacks. Nothing I can yet identify as the source. Hmm. Did you know that your assistant was one of them? Yes, well, believe it or not, I'm as shocked as you. More so, I dare say. He was so dedicated, so curious. But that's no excuse. I mean, how could I have been such a fool? You're lying. I'm supposed to believe you worked side by side with an enemy operative and never had any idea. And they call you a genius. Believe what you will, Agent. I was fooled. And by someone I came to care quite deeply about. I don't expect you to fathom the intricacies of human emotion, but I don't care for your insinuations. I am as much a patriot as any enlisted man. They didn't hire me for my sensitivity, Doc. Sorry if my heart doesn't go out for a traitorous alien. The question is, traitorous to whom? He provided us with invaluable information. Hmm. Before I go, tell me, why are you so valuable? Falk seems to think we can't win this thing without you. I suppose he regards the work I've been doing with ARPA as essential. I've been tracking audio signals gathered via telemetry. I shopped my findings around the scientific community for months. Anything concrete? Only subtle results, but Myron, Director Fork, recognized their import. I thought it was merely a curious anomaly, but he felt it was a warning. Guess now we know who was right. Okay. About sectopods. I think we killed the sectopod. Now we're recording. Lawrence, here. Lawrence, have you seen these latest findings? Just a moment, Alan. I'm finishing a minor change to your calculations. Oh, the hell with bloody hell. That's brilliant. Oh, I don't know about all that. It's just a minor change. You would have done it yourself in time. Maybe, but you're the one who did it today. If I'm not careful, you'll be replacing me as head of this project. And take away your prized work? Anyway. What was it you wanted to show me? What? Oh, it's these new transmissions that we've been receiving. Dr. Rossi believes they may be extraterrestrial in origin. Take a look. Extraterrestrial transmissions? You don't say. Think of it. Intelligent life on other worlds. A culture more advanced than ours reaching across the void to welcome us to the Brotherhood of the Stars. Alan, you're making some rather dangerous assumptions. Oh, I know it could be nothing. Some Soviet trick, perhaps. But think, Lawrence. If it really is from another planet, why, someday, our Vengate project could bridge our worlds. Yes, I suppose that could be possible. Why, this could be the start of a new chapter in human history. Yes, I'm afraid so. Okay. Now let's see if we can find this engineering bay. That'd be 
quite lovely if I could. What? What button? What button? What button? Am I? Oh, this button. All right. I can press buttons. Oh! are using this to immobilize targets in the field? Among other things, it's been a big help in construction, too. Uh, seems like it'd be a revolution for aircraft, too. Oh, you haven't heard about the other project, have you? Uh, what are you talking about? Nothing. Never. All right. Hey, I have no idea where this engineering bay is. No clue whatsoever. I'm sure I will run across it eventually. Uh, I was over there already, so maybe it's up this way? There. This is just all laboratory stuff. I've already been up here too. Oh! There it is. This must be it down here. Alright. Hey, but you're Heinrich. What do you want, buddy? What did you want to talk about? Yes, we've had a bit of a mishap, William. Ah, oh, great. As you know, our most pressing goal is to develop a test to determine the uh, humanity of our personnel, if you will. We've had a breakthrough. Discovering a signal which causes the zilicoids to become quite agitated. But as you can see... Your test subjects escaped? Indeed. Perhaps the signal agitated them a bit too much. Why haven't we been put on alert? Mit our current tension, can you imagine how people would panic? I'd rather we keep this little incident between ourselves, William. What exactly do you need me to do? The zilicoids are likely to be hiding in the ventilation or other subsystems. Their distinctive trail should make it easy for you to track them and destroy them. Good hunting. All right. So, something in the vents that I need to kill, or something? Alright, so I came all the way down here just for that. Alright. Alright, so let's head back up. If I remember how to get back up... Er, yeah, this way. What? It's in the oh no! Ah! What the? Quick thinking, Carter. I'll start a flush of the whole decontamination system now. Carter, Looks like I there? found the first of Heinrich's blobs. Blob. Okay. Was not expecting that at all. But luckily, I reacted excellently. <laughs> your practice in the field like I this place is massive have you heard about what they got down there what the hell all right so let's go just I'm completely disoriented I don't know where to go Carter what's this I hear about people sleepwalking through cities must be we're still figuring it out your guess is as good as mine Whatever the outsiders did to them, we don't know how to fix it. Sounds like a friend I knew back in the service. Mine just snapped. No, no, that's as true. As long as we still got people working on a cure, there's still a chance for them. Oh, right you are. Although if they can't remember it after they recover, that'd probably be a mercy. Uh, so what happened Tell to your me friend? more about that friend in the service. Anything like the sleepwalkers? Well, I can't say it was too similar. I mean, poor old Ken didn't have black gunk all over his eyes to start. But the things he saw when we were in the Great War. Terrible things happened during war. Anyway, he never got over the shock. And Myron and I never got over what happened to him. I just hope we can do more for those sleepwalkers. 
How are our food and water supplies? We should be able to hold off for another month, maybe more, with tighter rationing. How are our food Oops. and we should be. Able You've known the old man for a while. Has he always been this paranoid? No, not at all. In fact, I remember when he used to be a naive new recruit. What happened to him? Well, it's not hardly my place to tell his life story. But let's just say that sort of attitude doesn't last after the third time a refugee pulls a gun on you. That's enough prying for now. Any time, Carter. Okay. So if only I could figure out how to get back up to where I was. Maybe the ready room? It's pointing in that... No, ready room is where we just were. Um, wait, this looks familiar. Maybe? Yeah. No, it doesn't actually. Did somebody leave a mess like that. Whoa, oh, blub! Oh, oh boy, where is, it? where is it? There it is. What the hell's happening in there? <laughs> uh. Well, another blob down. Hope you washed your hands at least. <laughs> All right. Oh, on the bright side, I'm finding blobs. Oh, I found it! Yay! Back to where I wanted to be. Ha ha ha. Okay. Um. Maybe I should talk to Falk first. I do know how to get up there. That I do know. Oh, this door though. This is new. And what? I don't know if I want to go in there. Or in here. Yes. All right. Nothing to say to you. I'm going to get some answers. Good luck. Okay. Is Falk in his office? No, I don't think he is. But his cigarette is still smoking. Director, this is the prototype I mentioned. Okay. Mm. All right. Here we go. Yeah, I knew it. Uh. Oh. Holy Jesus, get that thing out of here! Yeah. Is there another one? What? Oh, What's going on, on in here? Get it! What? Where? Where is it? There we go. There we go. Got this. Got this. All under control. What's going on, buddy? Oh, another one. Yeah. Oh, another one. And here yeah. I got a nice quiet desk job. <laughs> uh. Oh, so Q and A's. Okay. Good to know. Can I go through here? Nope. 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 All right. Let's continue on. Let's actually go and do. Let's pick maybe a quest we can do. One of the main ones. Let's see. Oh wait. How do we get down? Uh, this way. You can't attend every threat yourself, but in some cases, you can dispatch agents to assist. On these dispatch missions, they will earn valuable experience and may find new equipment or even other experienced agents. However, they won't be available in the field while dispatched, hmm. so select your squads wisely. That's interesting. So I can send out people to do the missions for me. So I guess these ones are the ones that I can't actually do myself. Um, Okay. Rewards. Guardian pack reduces damage taken from all attacks. That would actually be good for... Uh, what, can Compton do it? Um, oh, I have to add more. Uh, Alright, hold on. Let's go back. Hold on. I think we can do this. Okay, let's send in Lafayette. 
Terry Belfler, Jason Stackhouse, and Alcide, and Hoyt. Yeah, alright, launch mission. Okay, how long does that take? I don't even know how long it takes, maybe like one mission. Is this a great mission? That's a minor operation. That's also a minor operation. Okay. So let's do maybe this one in Indian or Indianapolis, Indiana. All right. So recover an artifact. So these seem like they're pretty quick, it's like two or three fights, and then they're done. about this classified alien technology we're after. That it's classified alien and technological. That's not much to go on. Yeah, just the way Falk likes it. The man knows how to keep a secret. <laughs> All right, just follow the arrows. Garner, drone's headed for the creek. Cut through that cow shed. Roger that. Uh, Outsider spotted. Hey, spotted. They're after the same tech we are. Shit, what do we do? Thank them for finding it for us, then blow them away. Uh, we got hostiles! Mm. Finish it off! Take oh. shots. Yeah, all right. All right. Oh, next rank up. Shield sphere. All right, I'll figure that out. We're setting up. Need order. Move. Grenade. Uh. So many aliens. Oh, oh, I'm almost dead. That's not good. Walk it off. I actually like the shoddy quite a bit. Weapons dry. <laughs> Oh, it's shooting Commander, me. you're wounded. Keep uh. the pressure on him. Where are they shooting me from? Commander, you're wounded. I know I'm wounded. I know. Oh, that guy over there. Oh, that's a solid hit, Rose. All right, let's get a. Critical strike on. Hit it hard. Guy. Take it aim. Alrighty. I gotta move on up. I'm fading fast over here. <clears throat> Pin down. Uh, we can lift him up. Alley -oop! Perfect. Need 
Need a medic, Commander! Take cover! Grenade! Lock it off! Oh, we won. Excellent. Not really. Oh, there's still one more guy left. Alright, I think it was just because I was healing. There we go. Ah. Yeah, I'm good. Carter, how accustomed are you to being kept in the dark on a mission? What do you mean? I mean, Falk sends you out in the pouring rain and won't even tell you what you're after. Ours is not to wonder why, Barnes. Exactly.